problem with education today is the fact that we are still focusing on age dependent grades and what we have learned and what we have neglected is the fact that we understand that there are different developmental stages for children and therefore some need to be addressed more they need more attention they need uh, more time they need to be shown in different ways and this is ultimately what the all the accommodations aim to do if kids are getting the proper accommodations that they need but the problem is that we're still doing this in the same classes and there are schools that have programs where kids come out to other classes and things like that but they're still expected to be at the same level as the ones in the class likewise because of this focus uh, the students that are able to get this information and could possibly go farther are being neglected it's a truth of the matter and so to appropriate education for students it should not be age-based anymore that should have been thrown out a long time ago instead they should be uh, we should be spending the time figuring out what the independent students are individually and then giving them developmentally based classes as opposed to classes of same or like ages it, it would fix education and the 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 holdback the the reluctance of this is with the idea that kids are will be seen as lacking in areas and things like that and that's the mentality that really needs to be addressed it's not the fact that oh I'm in the dummy class or I'm in the smart class you are in the developmentally appropriate class for your capabilities and that that recognition then becomes the job of the teachers to get them to, still to this level that they're that they can graduate because ultimately what we're doing what what is being done in education is that kids are being passed along and some kids are being stifled from the growth that they could be they could be with kids that are more or less smarter like they they are able to by smart I mean able to understand higher levels of the subject matter so we let these kids be with other kids whether they are in fifth grade or if they're in high school like at least they're working together and they can see the the level of capabilities of other kids and be able to develop that even more because they're being in uh, developmental levels that are appropriate for them and so there is this level of like maturity that needs to be considered as well but if you're addressing age appropriate subject matter for their developmental levels the uh, behavioral problems are relegated to kids don't understand things and then if they don't understand things they don't know how to do things so they act up they're like I don't get this I don't understand what's going on so why should I be paying attention so if you put it at a level that they can understand it and do the things they want to do it kids want to do the things that they understand that they are good at that they can feel proud of so to put them in levels where they don't know what's going on causes them to shut down to act out to be bored so there has to be a level of interest that is developed and you can't develop interest if there is an age appropriacy so why are we still trying to sit kids in age specific classes instead of developmentally appropriate we should have thrown out the idea of age level grades a long time ago and just put it in like the this is this developmental level and we're going to address these things which we try to do we try to do with the idea of classes in subject matter you know if uh, take math for example there's basic math and trigonometry geometry algebra things like that but instead of it going to the next basic level and we try to do that 
it tries to make sense of it. But it needs to be focused also on the learning styles of the kids. And so maybe that's also the focus too, is like, oh, you're a auditory learner, you're a kinesthetic learner, you're at this level, these are the these are the classes that we should be developing as opposed to, okay, we're going to stick everybody that's 13, 14 years old in this class and 14, 15 in this class because that might not be appropriate for them. The pro we've been sticking with this traditional idea of age dictates development, which is not the case. And therefore, we speak on generalities because of this, you know, at this level, you should be at this, but we've learned very quickly that educational development is not age dependent. We could fix the education by just doing that. So that's all I have to say about that. Thank you for your time and your attention. Do more, do better.